Thank you. Just don't want to make you work too hard, Greg. We can do runs right now. Yeah, let's do that. Do some runs. I was just so excited that you kind of, you're not in the moment and I had to like kind of, all right, relax, just, just let your mind kind of forget about what's ahead and just get the run in right. And once I got the run in right and I was coming towards it and clicked fifth gear, I was just like, oh baby, here we go. And, oh man, come off that ramp. I didn't even want to look down. I was just looking for the landing. Where am I going to land? Where am I going to land? So coming over, I couldn't really tell with this with this roll in the way it is. It's such a big roll, um, a little bit different to the practice and uh, I couldn't tell where I was going to land and how smooth it was going to be. but worked out perfect and I'm just stoked to be on the other side of, uh, of Greece right now and, and, and still, still able to talk about it so I'm just stoked I got you know it was a, it was a challenge I set for myself and, uh, and you know up until this point a lot of people would have thought you know why take that risk it's kind of stupid you know and and it just kind of goes to show that you know you I just get so much out of this you know like all the work and the dedication that I've spent getting getting the things right it's worth it in the end it's worth taking that risk to know that that you succeeded in the preparation because if you don't take the risk you don't know if you did the work right or not you know uh staying clear-minded is, is the hardest part of it all really um but you know i've been been living like this now for a few years just kind of not letting my mind overtake my my body anymore you know because for, for a while there i used to sit and think and think and think and overthink and it's it's not a good thing it's it's an illness you know so i i got i got rid of that kind of way of living and just stay in the moment and uh there's a lot to think about as far as the running went, you know, as, as I kept doing the speed runs, I was picking up, you know, all right, I need to do this better, I need to kind of cut this angle better, and it's, it's making sure you get those parts of the whole thing right that's going to make the jump, it's going to make the jump for you, you know, there's nothing else that, you know, that you really, that needs to kind of be in your headspace, and you, this is it, you know, and I just click fourth, click fifth, and, uh, and just held on. It was a, it's a crazy feeling then because from that point on it was the first time that I really concentrated on what angle I was on and I was I kind of went over to the jump and scoped out what direction I wanted to shoot in and I was a big tree sticking up. I knew I wanted to aim for like the third branch over on the big tree so I'm coming to the ramp looking at the big tree looking for the third branch and I'm like all right this is where I'm going and and uh, and then you know leaving the leaving the ramp I can't even explain what that feeling's like just it's just like there's a wall there and you're just like, oh, and hit it. I mean, it was, it was crazy, so.